Let's try this problem. It says, um, titanium dioxide, the substance used as pigment in white paint, is prepared industrially by reaction of titanium 4 chloride with oxygen at high temperature. So it gives you the reaction there. And then it says, how many kilograms of titanium dioxide can be prepared from 5.60 kilograms of titanium 4 chloride? OK? So how do we figure this out? Well, we're going to have to do um, a number of calculations and remember a number of conversion factors, OK? So one of the conversion factors already we need to know is um, the conversion between kilograms and grams. Okay, do you remember that one? Mm -hmm. 1,000 grams equals one kilogram. Okay, so if you don't remember those, you're gonna make sure you know by the testimony. Okay? So, 5.60 kilograms of titanium chloride. Okay, so, what other conversion factors are we going to need to know? Well, let's just go through this problem and see what conversion factors we'll need to know. So we're eventually looking for the mass. Put it down here. The mass of titanium dioxide. Okay, and we have to start with this 5.60 kilograms. of titanium 4 chloride. Okay? So let's just convert that to grams. So 1 kilogram of titanium 4 chloride is 1,000 grams. So we can cancel out kilogram like that. Okay, so now we're in grams of titanium 4 chloride. But that's not what we want. We want the mass in kilograms of titanium dioxide. Okay, so do we know a conversion factor that will convert grams of titanium 4 chloride to titanium oxide? Do you remember? Well, it won't, you do need the molar mass, but it's not going to convert from titanium chloride to titanium oxide. It's going to convert from grams of titanium 4 chloride to grams of, or to moles of titanium 4 chloride. Okay? So down here, we're going to want something that's grams of titanium 4 chloride. And like you said, up here, one mole titanium 4 chloride. So whatever that is, that's the molar mass. Okay, so we got to figure out, well, what's the molar mass of titanium 4 chloride? So look at the periodic table. 35.45 uh, times 4 plus 47.88. So that equals 189.68 grams per mole of titanium 4 chloride. Titanium four chloride. So we'll put that down here. 189.68 okay. grams per mole. See that? So that cancels grams out. And now we have moles of titanium 4 chloride. Okay. Is there a mole to mole ratio that you can that you can figure out for titanium 4 chloride to titanium oxide? Do you remember what we used for that one? How to convert moles of titanium 4 chloride to titanium oxide? We've got to use the reaction equation up here. Okay? So the coefficients of the reaction equation tell us how to do that. So how many titanium 4 chlorides? is this, this coefficient telling us we have? 
One. One. Okay. So, and how many titanium oxides? Titanium oxide? Just one. Just one, right? So, in this case, it's one mole to one mole. So we're going to put one mole. That down there. One mole. Of that there. Okay? So that's where you get that conversion factor from the reaction equation. It has to be balanced. Okay, so cancel, cancel. Is that what we're looking for? Moles of titanium oxide? It's mass. Yeah. No mass. Oh, no. Uh -huh. So is that mass? Moles? No, not yet. Okay, so how do we get from moles back to mass? How did we go from uh, mass to moles before? So use the molar mass, 32, because that's two oxygens, plus 47.88. So titanium oxide, molar mass, is going to be 79.88 grams per mole. One mole. Titanium oxide. Is seventy nine point eight eight grams. Of okay. But I wanted the mass in kilograms. Is that kilograms? No. So how do we convert grams to kilograms? What do we put at the bottom down the here? Grams. So how many? Mm, one. Or it's a thousand grams. And then There's no reason to guess about this stuff, okay? We've already written all the things down. And up here? And one kilogram. One kilogram. Now all we have to do is multiply. And divide. Okay, so how many sig figs is our final answer going to be? Three. So in three, because that's the number that was given to us in the problem. So 5.6 times 1,000 divided by 1, 89.68 times 1. Times 79.88 divided by a thousand. And to three sig figs, I get 2.36 kilograms of TiO2. So that's how you would do that problem. If you started with 5.60 kilograms and it all went to the product. Questions on this?